So we are going in to our first ever Sanjay Leela Bansali film in theaters. In theaters. Never seen one. Um, hopefully on the way out, we'll be like, I'm so glad we got to see a Sanjay Leela Bansali film hope so. in theaters. <laughs> We're rooting for all of you. We really are. Let's go nepotism. <laughs> Back to our stupid reaction, it's Corbin. I'm Rick, and you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter. For more juicy content, juiciness. Uh, think about us on Patreon, and also subscribe if you haven't, and like this video if you uh, just to help the algorithm out a little bit. Uh, Give us love. Shower us with your unconditional love. Golden showers. <laughs> Today we're doing a movie review. <laughs> As you already already know, obviously. Yeah, you know you that. That's title. why you hit yeah. the play button. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but we uh, just came out. Well, we came out probably about thirty minutes ago. Yeah, and now we're, we're the theaters. rainbows. We're gay. Yeah. Oh, different kind of coming out. What you said? We just came out. <laughs> oh my god! Punch in the face. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the uh, we just watched. Literally came from the theater right yeah, now. Yeah, we, probably about thirty minutes fresh off of the film. Um, can you can you smell it? Can you smell the film? It's. We watched the new Sanjay Lila Bansali film, Gungubai Kas... I can't say the last one. I think they're just calling it Gungubai because it's easier for Gungubai? us idiots. Kathiwadi. Kathiwadi? Gungubai Kathiwadi. Huh? Gungubai. Uh, but anyways, the, uh, written and directed by uh, Sanjay Lila Bansali and uh, produced by Sanjay Lila Bansali mm -hmm. and uh, starring Ali Abad, uh and this is basically her vehicle. Yeah. Uh, this entire thing. Then there's cameos. Um, it's not a spoiler, they were in the thing, but right. Jay Devgun, VJ Roz, and a few other and our people in our ghost gym. Uh, but yeah, no as, spoilers, as well. those are in the trailer. Yeah, those are in the trailer. So, but, uh, so the way we'll do this, since it's a new film, we're going to do non-spoilers, and then we'll get into some spoilers if yeah. we want to. Because it's, brand it's new. a new film, uh, some people haven't seen it, and so we'll, this will be, I don't know if predominantly, but it'll be a good at, amount of non-spoiler, and then the front end. we'll let you know before we get into some spoilers yeah, since for you. Bunches of you probably have not seen this seen yet. Seen it yet. But, Rick, your initial thoughts, please. Uh, this is, for those of you keeping track and score at home, our 13th film of the year, our 137th Hindi film of all time, and our 220th film of all time. And here's my paragraph. As we were walking to the car to head to the theater, I said to Corbin, I have a bad feeling in my gut about this. He asked why. I said, because I've seen, uh, I've been seeing tweets from big names in Hindi cinema who've already seen this movie, and it reminds me of what I was seeing before 83. And those of you who've seen the 83 review, you know our review of that and some of the things that we disagreed with some of the accolades for it. Guys, you know how much we love Alia, and you know how excited we were to see this movie and still believe Alia and Sanjay are two of the most talented artists in this industry, but I will never lie. My love for the art form will always be higher than any love I have for any artists within it. Love Sanjay, love Alia, but I didn't like this movie. Overall, you didn't like it? Yeah. I can definitely say um, I didn't enjoy it as much as I wanted to, for uh -huh. sure. I, I can't say as far as I didn't like it. There's a bunch of stuff that I do, I, we'll, we'll get yeah. into, that I didn't that I didn't love. I think Alia was definitely the strongest part of it. Um, and there, there's some... Um, I don't know what... It's, it's, it's hard to really place the what the issue is, but I, I guess writing and, and editing, maybe? in term, Not like editing in terms of like... It was beautiful, obviously. Yeah, that's, that's a Sanjay Lee Bansali film. Can't deny that. Um, but the, the, those would probably be where I think it faltered in terms of like its pacing and what they decided to put on screen as opposed to who they decided to show you a blimp of every once in a while. Because really, like I said in the beginning, this is an Alia show. This is this is this is her. Uh, and then, like, if you're going into CVJ Raz, uh, he's, um, he's not in very much of it. Yeah. We'll let you know. And, and like, like most biopics, it's very heavy. Like, if you see the movie Spencer with Kristen Stewart playing, uh, Princess Diana, she, she, it's, it's all about her. Yeah. Which is usually the case when you're doing a, a, a heavy biopic, uh, whereas, you know, that, that, that's standard. But thing. anyways, yeah, yeah. Um, so I, I wouldn't say I disliked it, but, um. It would be more pl to, towards a C plus to a B minus uh, of a film uh, overall. That would uh, I was my expectations were an A. Uh, oh, like I was expecting an A plus through the roof. Uh, yeah, and, and I, so, I so mean, that, that that does 
obviously it, it is a disappointment if you're expecting an A yeah. and you, you got like a C plus to a B minus right. kind of grade from me. Um, overall, uh, I think the main reason you're going to want to watch this film um, is, is, is Alia doing the best she can uh, with, with some of the writing that she was given. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, yeah. From I get, I've simplified my rating system, as some of you know. Recently, I, for me, it's just basically: am I in or am I out? So, and I, for me, it's you're just, out. Yeah, uh, yeah I, I'm out. What would you think about Ollie? Let's talk about Ollie. I here's, well, I'm sorry, this is still no spoilers. Yeah, no spoilers. Still no spoilers. No spoilers. Here, but we're gonna um, talk about Ollie. Here. So I know very little about the woman she's portraying. Yeah. But what I do know about her, I have some questions about uh, the casting of Alia to mm. portray her. Mm. I think Alia did what Alia would do. Like, she did the very best that she can do with what she's given. Mm. Um, I just don't know that she was right for this part. Mm. I can think of several other actresses that, in my mind, were part of it. And this, I'm, I'm ready to admit that a big chunk of this could be just my own perception of her. You guys tell me if you have the same perception. But... Some of the weightiness and gravitas we saw that was in the trailer, I feel like that was kind of all that was there. And for the believability factor for her to be a hardened woman was difficult for me to see through everything that she was doing. I believed her emotional availability. Yeah. I believed her when she was talking to people and she's in the moment. I just didn't believe the totality of her being this person. I felt that there was an affectation that was happening in some places rather than an incarnation. Mm. I took it more as, because obviously you could have taken this character many different ways. I don't know this character at all, obviously, for outside of what they showed you in the thing. And so if you're obviously, um, yeah, obviously you could have put like a Radhika in this if she could have played like a younger, the younger self, And she could obviously. have, that she obviously. would have been... Um, yes, that that person, somebody who would be able to play, because as well, we only. Um, I don't want to get into any spoilers, but yet. I'm not going to get into any spoilers. Yeah, don't yet. get any spoilers yet. But anyway, um, yeah, I, I understand what you're saying. I took her character more as a, a, a woman who was kind of obviously taken from her youth, and so she's trying her best to be as tough as possible, but she's still a little girl inside, and that kind of came forward a bunch of times. And uh, for the most part, it, it 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 worked for me. Her worked for me. Um, I, the, the, rest, the, the rest of the film was um, a little choppy uh, for me in terms of them cutting forward to, to far further into life. All yeah, there's a little, lot I have to say about the a story. A lot of these little the things script. are like little blimps that I'm like, I wish you would have focused more on that. Yeah, I that was really interesting to me. Exactly. Um, and so the, 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 those things, I thought I, I enjoyed Ollie's performance. Uh, that's not really the, the, the issue I'd take with this film overall. Um, that would be more, I'd say, in the, in the writing and editing. But I, I do agree. If somebody else was in it, they, it would have given a different portrayal. But I didn't mind her portrayal of it, uh, of this character. It, it, it did work for me, and I thought she held her own when Weej Roz was on screen, when when oh, Jay was on definitely screen. Definitely holds her she, own. She did. A, I thought she did a very good job in that aspect. Um, I just. <laughs> maybe I maybe I'm just wanting like a, more of a gritty Anurag. Uh, <laughs> well, that, that and that begs that begs the we'll get into that in the, into spoilers. Some of the stuff I have about story and script for mm -hmm. me, yeah. Um, I th I would say if there's one area where I take my I have three areas of exception that didn't meet my expectation. Yeah. The first one would be script and story. Yeah. The second one would be some of the things I was expecting uh, directorial wise. And then last, it was it was Alia. But I, I, again, and I'm not saying this because I need I don't I, like I said at the beginning, I value the art form more than do artists. If I thought she sucked, I would tell you, wow, I'm so sorry, Alia, you sucked. It wasn't that she was bad. It was that I felt like she did the best. Very different film, but you know when I talk all the time about Daniel Day Lewis in Nine, mm. and it's like I'm watching him in Nine, and I'm like, mm, I I don't I wouldn't have cast Daniel Day Lewis in Nine. I don't think that was his, by far, for me, that's his weakest thing. I would never recommend Daniel Day-Lewis in Nine, mm. but you can't deny that Dan... I feel the same way, though. It's a different film for mm. this. As I as I was watching it, I, I, I couldn't help but thinking about the different actresses that I felt could have portrayed the character base, not just also on what we saw on the screen, but the little I know, having done a little teeny bit of research for the character, uh, without getting spoilers as to who this woman was in, in history. Mm. Uh, and that's the other thing. We can get into story without giving away spoilers. I'm I'm trying to comprehend what it is about this story and about this woman that w was so compelling it needed to be told. Uh, it, 
I, I don't have a problem with the story in terms of them telling this story. It's a story of, obviously, a girl who was sold into prostitution and came up in that world. I'm fine with that. I'm, I like gangster stories. It doesn't, I don't, I don't need a moral to the story, even though there was a moral to this story, obviously. Um, I'm not going to give that away. Um, and I guess, I guess because we can get into spoilers. Yeah. It's not so much that I felt that, <laughs> this is the way I should better phrase it. Mm. It's not why was the story needing to be told. Why, why was the story told this way? That's my biggest exception I have. Because based on what I know about her. As opposed to like a, a more. I don't want to give away anything yet. As opposed to like a more gritty telling of a Let's more, just say that, yes. But for now. I'll get into it in the non-spoiler section. I guess it's just to, I'd have to go back and watch Padmavat uh, in terms of Padmavat was driving almost nine in terms of how gritty they went. They're not. That, yeah, they're not. I think it's. I think it's just his style. And but comparatively, storyline wise, um, this this begs. I mean, for that style of, of of film. What I know about this woman. Yeah, I I I, I get that, and that's that's what might be one of the disconnects in terms of why I didn't enjoy it as much as I wanted to. Because I wanted that, I and, wanted I wanted the animal to be unleashed in Aria, and, I, and, and I think she did sometimes in terms of some. But I really wanted the exactly, the, and the I, I really do feel this. Like, if people just want to go to the movie and be entertained with a, with a story that's going to touch on subject matter that they typically wouldn't even go near, yeah. they're going to enjoy this a lot more than somebody who wants to see realism. And if, especially if you're doing a biopic about somebody. You're, you're, you, I'm trying not to say stuff to give anything away. Uh, I think there's, like, a lot of films, there are films that have an audience, and like, you say you love the movie, more power to you. I'm so glad mm -hmm. you went and had a great time, because that's what I wanted. I don't, like, we don't yeah. ever go to the movies not wanting to enjoy it. Yeah. But, for, yeah, for me, I just, I yeah. was disappointed. Uh, the other stuff I, that I did enjoy, obviously, it was a very pretty film. It was a Sanjay Liv and Sally yeah. film. Uh, it was, he, he used the color blue, a lot, and obviously I think that was important, similar to how yeah. um, he also Zoya had didn't use he, blue. He also had some really in the early part had a really beautiful, like a pink yeah. working in the in the twilight moments. He used shadows. So, yeah, really you well. can't it's, deny the, if if you want to go just for to watch that as well. You're gonna it's you're a gonna Sanjay it's it. a Sanjay film. It's 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 it's, it's you're gonna get. Your Sanjay fix in terms of the visuals, for sure. Yeah. And the cinematographer, I don't want to... Sudeep uh, Chatterjee. But, but you won't get, and I don't think it's supposed to be that, just letting you know in advance, if you're expecting Bajira Mastani or Padmavat yeah. visuals, you're, you're no, not no, going to no. get that. It's not supposed to be that. No, it's it's still beautiful. It's, and still, it's beautiful. still very he's, striking. He's still the painter of light. Yeah, yeah. You know? Symmetry is his game, man. Yeah. Uh, I thought the, um, the, uh, the songs were nice. There were none that were amazing i don't think in terms of i enjoyed like, them i, I enjoyed yeah. all of them yeah um but none that like i think my favorite was the one we reacted me. to probably it's Agreed. still i still that's I still, still my favorite i still think that's my favorite that one comes the closest to me for like some of the other numbers we've seen from, from Bajra. sanjay films yeah from Bajra 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 and, and, and even ramlila to really enjoy yeah yeah those are those are great the supporting cast uh as little i mean the ones that were the big ones we're talking about like uh vj raz he was amazing He's not in it very much, let me tell you that, guys. Yeah, you, uh, that's not a spoiler. You just need to know that if you're expecting a lot, like we, we were kind of expecting a little bit more of him, yeah. but you know, he's he's um, not a lot of them. Get, Dev Gunn was nice. Uh, mm -hmm. He's probably in it the most of the supporting people, Correct. except Jim in the oh, second half. In the second half, Jim, our, our dost, he's in it quite a bit. I actually thought he did really well. He was a very different character than even what we just yeah. saw, which was nice. But As well, and uh, AJ did a very AJ good job. AJ did a very good job. Yeah. Uh, and so... Uh, um, overall, in finishing up the non-spoilers, I think the, the main thing is just, I think a, a lot of people will enjoy this film. I, I, it didn't live up to my very high expectations. No. And for I, sure. I, what I was mentioning at the beginning, here's, still like it, here's what bothers I, me. I didn't like the end, actually. I, I will say that. Here's what bothers me. I really hope folks that are big names in the industry that tweet and use words like masterpiece uh, beyond spectacular. I hope that's not being done because that's what you're supposed to do because it's the business that really makes me sick. Mm. Um, it, it happens. I know it happens. I'm not naive, and I know there's people that do it. I'll never do it. But granted, um, they might have also thought that. Um, it, that's my hope. That is my genuine. I've already, I hope so. I've already had stupid babies reach out to me and yes. say they feel the same way. I've about had this stupid films. babies tell me they love it. That it's a, a wonderful motion picture. 
more I I have no argument with you that it impacted you that way. I can see why somebody would go and see this and enjoy it and not have a film critic hat, hat on and walk away and enjoy it. It's just really tough for me to see like when a movie comes out sometimes movies and it used to never be this way, but critics and people will rave about something and then people I know and I will go see something and go I don't know what that's about. Yeah, but I I don't know if that's the case with this movie. I hope um, not. Because I, really hope I not. think there's enough that certain people might feel like this film would be a masterpiece for some people. And not for me. It's not a masterpiece for me. But um, as opposed to like... Because uh, like we were disappointed with probably two of the other films that came out in theaters, 83. And I'm not as disappointed in this as I was with those two. Uh, I will say that. Um because I, especially Push by Push by was obviously excruciating. Yeah, I, I'm. it's equal for me. Like, all three for different reasons. Mm -hmm. and, and the reason for this one is because of the three, this is the one that had my expectations in its highest But there's place. certain things it in It didn't this, fall as far away this, for me. But this thing, I could actually... There's certain things in it that I, I can praise. I, that's true. And those ones... Uh, there, there's some well, there's some 83. things in 83. Some things, but not yeah. as much as this. This has much more I, you're appeal. You're right. No, I, you're right. I would say that I can see why this would have I more don't, appeal. Like, there's certain people that will say... Um, obviously, Ali just has haters, and I'm not talking about yeah, those people. Exactly. Uh, but, like, in terms of... I. I at least in my opinion, I don't think this is a bad film. It's just, it's not, it didn't live up to the, ex and it was almost impossible to not have the hype, obviously. As yeah, of course. Film and and, and, Ollie, and, of and, course. and so my, maybe my expectations were way too high. Uh, Admittedly, that could they, be the they case with maybe, me too. That may be could the be. case. Um, but I, even still, I don't think, in my opinion, I don't think you can call this a bad film. I think it's, it, I think it could have been edited down some. In terms of the length, uh, I think it could have been edited in terms of how they how they d weave the story a little better, and I think some of the writing could have been a little. Mm, in terms of, I'm just keeping yeah, it solid. Yeah, if we can not talk, it, not 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 no. talking like giving it to Anyrog and making him. It doesn't his need film. to be. I mean, come on, just because it's a gangster movie, it doesn't yeah. have to be Anyrog. Exactly. Um, but yeah, so uh, you can let us know what you thought about it in the um, if you're still here. But we're gonna get into a little spoilers spoiler time here. So if you haven't watched it. Go watch it, and then you can come back, and uh, we'll talk about it. So, um, I, the, the the one issue I did have, I didn't like the end at all. Uh, at, me too. Absolutely, I did not like the whole procession. It was almost like it was like a Disney parade. Yeah, like uh, curtain calling. I, agree. I I did not like that at me all. Me too. <laughs> and the students there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I that that part was probably my least favorite of the entire film. It summed it up for me with a ribbon in yeah. a way that there were aspects of it that I was like, I. Uh, if this is a story worth telling, then it should be told the way it happened. Mm -hmm. And this lady, as far as I know, mm -hmm. wasn't just a prostitute and a madam, but she was a mafia queen. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And she made sure people got murdered. Yeah, I was hoping And there get... were drug deals that yeah. were... I mean, she I, was... I was hoping was, they were getting into that, like some of it. I thought from the... That was, that's probably my single biggest disappointment in this film was like... When it started, I was like, okay, cool. This is what I expected when they did the girl yeah. and her everything. I'm like, okay, Sanjay's going to take the gloves off here and he's going to tell us a gritty story about a real woman who did some pretty awful stuff yeah. but still had some qualities about her that made it like this weird paradigm. Didn't go anywhere near that. Yeah, I thought I thought like at times when, uh, once again, we're in spoilers, like when the the person was trying to interrupt her after she was drinking, I thought she was like going to flip a switch, turn around like, Shoot him, stab him, something like I, all she ever did was really slap people. That's and that's what I was talking about at the beginning. I was waiting for that animal to be released, and maybe yes. that's not who she was. She was the one killing it. I could be wrong, but what I know about her is that she was I'm a saying mafia she, queen. I know, but I was saying maybe she isn't the one that like pulled the trigger. Well, yeah, but then let's see someone pull it. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I, that's one of the things I, I just wanted that side of that character because I. But some people are like, why are you praising a mafia? I don't care about that. Uh, but I wanted you to portray a mafia person and and show yeah because it's well, that's a, it's not a it's not a pretty profession. Well, I do. <laughs> there is an app. I absolutely agree. I believe that there are people. If she is what I've read, if this lady in history, she she may have done some things to get some rights for some people and things yeah, of that yeah, yeah. nature. However, the context in which all of that is happening, she is a she is a woman who was a prostitute, and then became a madam. 
and then became a mafia queen who had people murdered and did drug deals. Yeah. And to present for the masses a presentation of this person from history just, that doesn't really show that side yeah. can easily turn her into a hero mm -hmm. rather than turn her into a very complex person who had a broken life but still had some traits about her that wanted to get equal, yeah. right? You know what I mean? I wonder why they didn't go into that, that side of it. Um, and there was, obviously, like I said, I, I, Ollie is my favorite part of this film. Uh, I thought she brought uh, it as much as she could with the, the script that, that she was given. I, I, uh, I, I agree. I think that she did the best with what she um, could, with what she had. I just... But I also, I think, I also I think have it, cast her in the role. Uh, I don't know about... Even though I... There's a thousand actors that I could tell you that would have done a great job as well. Um, I, I don't fully agree with that because they also had to portray her really young. And all the people I'm thinking of cannot do that young that they were trying to portray here. Um, with the, maybe the exception of Radhika. That's the only one that I can really think of that, that might have been a, a good choice. But also Radhika is not a big name. And unfortunately, it's a business. Uh, <laughs> and therein, for me, lies the I don't give a crap. Um, Regardless, I don't agree that she should have been casted because uh, I do think she did a good job. And um, I just think if it was written differently, um, they could have made her performance even better, obviously. Because obviously, great acting can only do so much. Great writing it's, can make it to another level. It's the script, obviously. Script is king. Um, and uh, just like when they were kind of shallow portraying her character, some of the dialogue was a little shallow at times Agreed. as well. Agreed. Not all the times. No, 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 no. No, there was some really Sometimes. good scenes. And cliche in some yeah, points. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, um, there, was, there was a cringe line for me in the, when she's talking to the to the priest and said that the, the kids know their alphabet because they hear those sounds. I was like... Oh, really? <laughs> um, once again, we're in spoilers. Uh, I, I loved VJ. I thought when he came on screen, uh, the tension was so amazing, I, and the I scene so much more was of that character. so good. Well, and that, and I was like, okay, we're getting into the nitty gritty. Well, and that here. was another part. And then it went away. What kind? That's I don't, the I don't even know. About. And this is editing and script screenwriting. I don't even know what kind of a threat his character played for Gungabai other than she needed to win the election and didn't like her. What did VJ's character do that was such a threat? Mm. Yeah. I don't know, do you? Yeah. I wanted I just wanted them to go deeper into those like you could have focused for an hour on their relationship and I would have been Yeah, just absolutely why thrilled. they're combatants. Yeah. And I think that would have been an amazing like tension because the tension was there immediately oh, you can't we had we had for me my favorite part of the film mm -hmm. is the two minutes and 48 seconds whatever it is mm -hmm. when vj walks into the room mm -hmm. and s sits down beside alia at the that, at the dinner i mean at yeah, the table. At when when he's been calling her and she's not going to meet well. and he finally walks in and she has the food in her hand and he says i don't need a plate yeah <laughs> that for me that is the movie for me yeah, yeah, if yeah. they had done more of that I would have been jumping up and down, I just raving. Obviously, how amazing VJ Rod is. Yes, man. the dude is. Uh, he's so good. He, <laughs> every he brings the same as like Bankaj, same as all those heavyweights of and, just. And I immediately when he walks on screen, I he brings this weight and presence and and like, we've stepped up enough. Yes, absolutely. And yeah. I understand. I understand when people want to make a story more accessible to a broader audience. There are certain times I believe that needs to come into play. Mm -hmm. I just don't know why this woman's story wouldn't have been told for all of the raw red light district reality that mm. she came from. That it felt Disneyfied. Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. And then uh, let's see. Uh, it talked about Jim. I thought Jim did a really good job there at the end. Uh, I thought all like, the girls. We should give a yeah, shout out. Yeah, I think to, all the. I thought funny. the girls did well. I thought that, they that all, were the, all the prostitutes. I agree. I thought yep. they did a really good job. I thought they the the one at the beginning uh, who reminds me of um, actually Shade's mom, uh, the madam running the, the madam. Place. I thought yeah. she was good. Uh -huh. she, um, I think uh, Shade's mom could have also done that role as well. She, yeah, and she, she really could have been amazing as well. Any heavyweight role like yeah, that, yeah. She but she she did. She did. Yeah, I thought she job. did a good job. Um, I don't know, man. I guess I just um, yeah. I I think my biggest issue would probably have been just. How they presented everything. Yeah, as you right as you said that, I was looking at the picture of Alia there, and I felt like, man, it, it's almost like um, serving milk in a whiskey glass. Mm -hmm. It's like, I I love milk, but mm -hmm. 
I wanted whiskey. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and maybe our expectations are way too high. But I think it was almost impossible not to be. How could it not be? Yeah. It's like anytime Spielberg does a movie for me, how is my expectations not going to be through the roof? If, if you have a film coming out Daniel that, Lewis. If, that has Anurag Kashyap and Nawaz and Pankaj in it, I mean, there's no way my expectations are not going to be through the roof. Uh, anything Zoya does, yeah, so, my expectations going to be through the roof. So if it's a Sanjay, big Sanjay Lee Benzali production with Ali Abad. Yeah. Um, yeah, and it sucks because, I mean, sometimes I've raved about a film and I said, yeah, I think this would be minus film, and I was more happy well, about right, it. Right, more happy about it. Yeah. So maybe, like, I think maybe that might have been one of the big issues is that uh, my expectations were just massively through the roof. Um, and obviously, I'm sure your grade's much lower than mine, but... Um, yeah, you guys can let yeah, us know. Yeah, if I, if, I, if, I if I was forced to give it a grade um, overall for me, since I'm out, I wouldn't, rec- wouldn't recommend it, then I would be giving it a C. Mm. Yeah. Um, because it's not a failure by any stretch of the imagination. It's mm-hmm. just a disappointment, and I feel like the primary difficulty I have, and I probably would have appreciated Alia's casting more, if I hadn't been given milk in a whiskey glass, but had been given straight whiskey, I had been hoping that we were going to see Alia portray a mafia madam who was going to do some really frickin' Nawazid and Siddiqui with Anurag Kashyap stuff. Mm-hmm. And we didn't come anywhere close to it. Again, maybe I shouldn't have had that expectation. But with this lady's story, why not? Yeah, with Alia about as And with well. Alia. And, uh, She's a phenomenal actress. She's a phenomenal actress. And I still think, I think, I mean, I still think this is actually one of her better performances. Um, not, uh, even though I might be more disappointed with the film, um, I think it could have been her best performance. Yeah, if I it think was if it had it differently. I think if it had been, I think it's whiskey still whiskey one of her, glass. I think it's still one of her better performances. So if this makes any sense, it could have been a legendary performance. I think it could have been yeah. too. Um, now it I hurts. Think... <laughs> <laughs> so you guys can let us know what you thought about this film uh, and why we're idiots or why yep. you agree with us or Get whatever. Get mad at us. Whatever you want, man. Whatever you want. We love you, Alia. Love you, Sanjay. Yeah. Really love you, Vijay. Uh, yeah. Very much. So, very, very so. much. <laughs> let us know what you thought about the film down below.